guys welcome back to my channel my name is Samantha Rizundu if you haven't been here before and today I am doing <laughs> I am doing my lipstick declutter slash collection so I think I will be getting a few of the rid of a few of these uh, because there are some that are just like really old or some that I've been given and I just don't like them uh, so as you can see I am a lipstick fanatic I think lipstick is probably consistently been my favorite thing in makeup. I love neutral, I love lip gloss, I love red, I love purple, I love orange. If you're here to see a 50% declutter, then that's not going to happen here. Uh, this is going to be very much a lipstick collection with some decluttering, uh, so you guys can see what I own, what I love, what I don't love. I might even start with like liquid lipsticks. realize so here we have all my lime crime so I've got two four six eight fifteen I've got fifteen liquid lipsticks from lime crime so let's start with those so I've got two of the red velvet here and it's actually my favorite red that I own so it's not the worst thing in the world and I will show you some swatches I'm not going to show you all swatches but this is the most beautiful true red and it's my favorite. So it's my favorite formula for a liquid lipstick and this is actually my favorite red that I own. Uh, next I have Wicked which is a really dark red. I'm going to keep that one. I have Rustic. I have a lot of reds because I love red in a liquid lipstick. I'm going to keep that. Isn't that beautiful? I have New Americana. I love this one too. Oh, look at that. Now this one here is called Happy. I, th I don't think I need this one. I don't wear it and I don't think I will wear it. It's actually a metallic. So I think I'm going to declutter this one. Here I have Faded. I really like this one. Oh, whoops. Here we have Cupid, which is another gorgeous color. I am swatching all my Lime Crimes because I love them so much, keeping that one. Here I have Salem, which is like a brown. I'm going to keep that one. Oh, this color is stunning. This is True Love. It is so beautiful. I'm just obsessed with this color. This one here is called Red Hot, and this is a metallic red. This is a Christmas shade right here. I'm going to keep that one. This one is Shroom. I don't know if I need this one. I think I'm going to declutter this one. And this one here is called Squash and it's an orange. And this one is like so unique. I want to keep it because I want to do, I would wear this as like a brown to this shade ombre type of situation. Next I have Wisteria. Oops, I'll put this near. I love this shade. Isn't it pretty? So I'll definitely be keeping that one. I have Dream Girl. Oh, that's very similar to this one. I don't think I need Dream Girl. I think I like more of this one. So I'm going to let go of Dream Girl. I can't believe we've got three Lime Crimes decluttered. Wow, this is... That's big for me. Oh, that's all the lime crimes. Okay. Okay, so this one is in the shade Push Up. And these are more of a muted liquid lip. Isn't that pretty? I'm going to keep that one. This one is in Exotic. And these are the lingerie line. Oh, I love that one. Ruffle Trim. Oh, I like that too. Cashmere Silk. I really like the formula of these. Yeah, I think I'm going to keep all of those. I know I have another one of these somewhere, so if I find it along the way. These are more of a lip cream, and I am going to keep all of these. These are the Girl Boss Demi Matte Lip Creams from Australis. I have Success and Me, and I'm pretty sure I have the Empower shade as well, so I'm going to keep those. Here I have the Melted Matte. Oh, I don't know about this. I don't really like the formula. I'm going to keep it because I really like the shade, but it's not my favorite formula. 
Here we have a few that I got from this uh, subscription box I bought. I had a while ago and I, I didn't have it for very long, but I got these shades. I think I've even decluttered some already and these are the ones I kept. I'm gonna declutter this pink one. I don't really use these anymore, I used to. I'm gonna declutter these three and I'm gonna keep these two. I have this little Urban Decay um, sample in Big Bang. This is a long lasting liquid lipstick. It's not a good formula and it's a glittery hot pink. So it's just not my cup of tea. So I'm gonna declutter that. I love this Lime Crime Plushy in the shade Lavender Honey. It's so pretty. So this is like a, what do you call it? A blotted, blotted lip. Next I have this Tartius Lip Paint. Um, I don't think I need this one. Nah, I don't need this one. I'm going to get rid of this. Oh, I love my Bare Minerals. This is in Boss and it's a matte lip. I love this one. So I'm going to keep that one. And then I'm going to go into like more like lip creams. Uh, this one is the Melted Liquefied Longwear Lipstick in Chihuahua. I actually am trying to finish this because it's a little sample size and I have it in my everyday bag when I just want something that's like a nude. I really like this one, so I'm gonna keep that and put it in my bag. Oh, there's my Empower, so I'm gonna keep that as well. Here are my more lip cream stick situations. This is the Their Real Benefit. I've never used this, but I want to because it has the lip liner in it. I got it at that Benefit sale I was talking about in my last declutter video. So I do wanna keep that and actually use it. This is the Pure by Re Revolution it's like a lip cream and the shade is pure. I quite like it, so I'm gonna keep that one. I have the ColourPop Just a Tint in Island Time. I love this. This is a really nice nude and it's quite sheer. I love, love, love this one. Okay, so I have these two nude sticks and I don't love them. I think I'm gonna declutter them. They're too matte. They're so drying that I like it goes on so creamy and beautiful. But then it just dries down so much that you get all crusty and I'm just not into that. Next I have this blotted lip by 3 Concept Eyes. I love this. It's just like a red blotted lip and I just adore it. I wore it in my K-Beauty haul video. This is the Lime Crime Lip Blaze in Moss. I love this. I wore this in one of my makeup tutorials. It was a lip and glass skin tutorial and I wore this brown. It's just stunning. So I love that. I have, this is new to me, this is the Makeup Revolution We Rule, it's like a metallic and I haven't used it yet, so I do want to keep it and just give it a try. I don't know how much I'm gonna love it, but. And then we're gonna go on to glosses, cause I want to, glosses and lip balms. And two more lipstick sticks. Um, this is another one that I'm gonna declutter, the nude sticks um, in shade Vintage. I got them in like a pack. And then this is the ColourPop Lippy Stick. Oh my God, this is so good. It's actually sheerer than I thought. But you can build it up and it's the most gorgeous shade. It is called Day Trip. Okay, let's do lip balms. Here are my two Burt's Bees. I've got Wild Cherry and Ultra Conditioning. It's not Ultra Conditioning. Um, I am panning this one. I'm trying to finish it. I use it every day. And I'm going to finish it. I'm really close. And then I have this Revlon Glow Lip Oil. I don't love this lip oil. I do use it because I bought it and if I need a little conditioning, I'll use it. Or if I want like a little tint when I go out the door, I'll wear this. Um, but it's not a very good lip oil, so I don't highly recommend it. But I will keep it. Uh, this is a Max Factor. I don't even know what this is. It's got no name, but I <laughs> love it. I'm going to finish it. Um, I use this, I put this in my everyday makeup bag, in my bag bag. It's just like a nice red tint balm. It's really nice. It's really conditioning as well. So I'm definitely keeping that. I don't even think you can get it anymore. It's quite old. This is uh, Same Mool, which is a K-Beauty brand essential tint lip balm. I love this so much. My best friend bought this for me in Korea, South Korea, I should say. And it is so moisturizing and it has a beautiful pinky tint. So I'll definitely be keeping that. Okay, one that I do want to get rid of is this Dear Darling Tint. It smells funny. It tastes weird. 
and it's just not a good color for me. So I am gonna get rid of this one. Here's one that I'm gonna get rid of. This is a Lime Crime Diamond Crushes. It's like a lip topper. Here are my two Kiko Milano glosses. This is my favorite gloss formula in the history of time. It is basically this very similar formula to the, sorry, I got another gloss here, the Fenty Beauty Gloss Bombs. I find them very comparable and I think they're cheaper. You cannot buy these in Australia. This is an Italian brand. You can buy it in Europe. Uh, so um, I'm almost finishing this one. I wear this on days very similar to my other like lip balms with a tint. If I just want something when I'm not wearing makeup and I just want a tint, I'll wear this. And then this one is just gorgeous too. It's like more of a orangey neutral. So I'll definitely be keeping these. I love these so much. They are called the 3D Hydra Lip Gloss. I believe these are sold in America now at Ulta, the brand. I don't know if these lip glosses are sold there, but I think Ulta sells Kiko now, which is pretty cool. Um, I just showed you my Fenty Beauty keeping this. This is the mini in Fussy. I've got two NYX Butter Glosses. I have the Cream Brulee and Ginger Snap. I actually think I'm gonna get rid of the Ginger Snap. I just don't wear it. And when I wanna wear a brown, oh look, I've got two. And I've got Praline. I'm gonna get rid of both of these. Because when I want a brown lip, I, I wear something with a bit more pigment. This is just a little bit too sheer, so it looks a bit weird on my lips. Okay, I've got the Hailey Baldwin for Model Co. It's really old, it's in the shade beige, but I really like it, so I'm gonna keep it. It's like a really nude gloss. Um, This is like something I don't need, but I do find myself every so often using it. And this is the Lime Crime Carousel Gloss. Yeah, Carousel Gloss in Snowsicle. I don't even think you can buy this anymore. It's just a clear gloss with some white-based glitter. Here's another gloss that I like from that subscription I used to have but I no longer have it's a really nice gloss so I'm gonna keep that I'm probably gonna keep all my glosses actually so yeah I've got two savvy I'm gonna keep those I have the one from Furless Cosmetic the convertibles in I don't know what shade this is it doesn't tell you the shade on here which is annoying and I've got the It Cosmetics in perfect nude this is actually the perfect nude oh my god it's amazing and then I've got this really old L'Oreal type of gloss in Rose Melody and it is just stunning and it is really moisturizing. So I'm going to keep those as well. Oh, this is a lip balm that I don't like. A lip, It's called a lip gloss from uh, Steve Laurent Beauty. I got this in a Bella box. I don't like it. I don't use it. So I'm going to get rid of that. That's a lip scrub. It's my only lip scrub. So I'll keep that. And then let's go in with my little mini Shiseidos. I'm going to keep all of them. My dear friend that I work with gave me these. It came in like a little beautiful set uh, because I helped her with advice for something. And so she gave me this. Isn't that so sweet? We have Rose Hip, Exotic Red, we have Dark Fantasy, and these are a matte finish. Disrobed and sling back beautiful red i'm going to keep those and this is another mini that i have it's the nars liquid lipstick in star woman definitely keeping that it is oh a true blue red another mini i have the bare minerals bare pro i don't have a shade name but i really like it so i'm going to keep it because it's a nice little nude Okay, so this is one of my most worn lipsticks, the Urban Decay Back Talk. I'm keeping this. This is in my project pan. This is my Savvy lipstick. It's a very affordable, cheap lipstick in pretty pink. I've almost finished it. I put this in my makeup bag as an everyday. I have this Savvy. I'm going to declutter this one. I don't use it. I have better reds. I have this Sports Girl lipstick that I don't like in the shade Bloom. It's too pale and it's not a good formula. So I'm going to get rid of that one. I have the Revlo Revlon Revolution in No Perfection Yet. I don't think I've even used this. I have no interest. It's not even in the, it's not set in there properly. It's, it's just really bad quality. So I think I'm just going to give that away to a friend. I have this Designer Brands Moisturizing Lipstick. My daughter accidentally touched it, but it hasn't been used. So I am going to donate this one as well. Uh, this is the Model Co. Luxe Cream Longwear Lipstick. Just, 
I have tried it, but I don't love it. So I'm going to get rid of that one too. And then I've got all my Ulta 3s. So in here I've got two that are in my project pan, sandalwood and brown sugar. So I'm keeping those. And then all of these, I definitely don't want this one. It's like a sparkly mauve. I don't like that. I don't need this pretty berry because I've got some other berry ones that I prefer. Prom night. It's not a very good formula, this red, uh, so I don't like that. I find the Ulta 3 nudes are much better than their pigmented ones. And then this is Caramel Kiss. Mm, nah. I've got other similar shades, so I'm going to get rid of that one too. So basically you can see almost everything. So I might start up the back. I need to get rid of this. It's so old. It's like an ultraviolet blue stick by Cryolan. It's so cool, but I'm never going to use it. So I'm going to uh, actually have to throw this one out. And next we have this Karen Mural Poppy Passion. I really like this one. It's such a pretty pink. Oh, we're going over. We're moving. And this is sold at Priceline. This is in a New Zealand lipstick brand. So Poppy Passion by KM, Karen Mural. Uh, next we have the Freedom lipstick. I think I might declutter this. I was keeping it because it's a really fair pink shade, but I don't think I'm going to use it. So I'm going to get rid of that one too. Oh gosh. Okay. So <laughs> my camera cut out, but I didn't actually lose much footage. So uh, what I did while I was waiting to transfer the file to check, I just cleaned the drawer and I'm actually going to reposition these here. I like it more and then have everything that I had before on this side. Change is good people. So yeah, let's continue. What I got up to was, and I also washed my hand and look how stained it is. So this is my lipstick queen in the shade Saint Bordeaux. It is Gorgeous. I love this one. It's like a sheer brownie red. This is my Mac in Victoriana. This was a special edition collab with Toledo. I don't know. I was young when I bought this. It's really old and I don't want you guys to judge me, but I'm going to keep it because it's the most beautiful red shade ever. And I actually need to make a conscious effort to use this more before I have to throw it out because it needs to be thrown out. <laughs> what I might do is do all my Macs now that I'm on Mac. So this is Sweet Succulents. I love my Mac lipsticks. Dark, deep purple. Love it. I have Sin. The formula is just so good, which is a dark, dark red. We have Heartless Flame. Gorgeous. And then this is my actual fave. I, one of my most favorite lipsticks, Rebel. So yeah, I'm keeping all of those. Let's go into my Inglot because I'm a little bit not sure about my Inglots. This is in the shade 433. Um, I think these are all matte. I don't know. These are so similar. Oh my God, Sam, why did you do that? Sorry, that one was 421 and then this is 175. I think I'm going to keep this dark, dark purple. I love dark purple. Honestly, I think I'm going to get rid of both of those Inglot. I never wear them. I actually probably wear the Inglot one the most, this one here the most. Uh, you know what? I actually might keep one. I think I'm going to keep this real pinky shade. Bite Beauty lipsticks. So this is the multi-stick cocoa. I'm undecided what to do with this. I need to actually try it out. I want to see if it works as like a contour. And this is Charisse. So I will keep them for now. I just want to play with them a bit more. This is the buttercream lipstick in Heather. Oh, that is so pretty. And then we have Amuse, two Amuse Bouche lipsticks in cotton. This one is Cotton Candy Fiano. I've used this one quite a bit, actually. I really like this one. It's really strange color, but paired with a lip liner, it's really, really nice nude. So I've got my Huda Beauty lipstick in Spring Break. And my daughter destroyed it. Look at the tip. It's okay. I'll forgive her. 
I'll forgive her because I love her. But it's so pretty. It's almost got like a bit of a orangey pink to it. I really like it. And then this is my Winky Lux Lip Velour in Dirty Love. This is a great, great brick red orangey lipstick. And it's a really good formula. I really highly recommend it. And it looks like it's such a cute little bullet. I love this lipstick. Uh, this is my NARS. Disco Dusk Lipstick in Debbie. This was the Christmas collection and it's got this beautiful sparkle situation going on. Um, I was having a really bad day and I wanted to pick myself up so I bought this. It's actually a purple with like a gold glitter. I don't know why I bought it. I can't let it go because it's NARS. So that's that. This is Damage and it is a sheer purple lipstick. The sheer lipsticks are so nice, but they get so gross because they're so emollient. Bad Reputation, which is a satin, which is a very popular one. Isn't that pretty? Sheap, which is a matte. I'm obsessed with this one. And then lastly, we have Cru Cruising, which is a sheer. Oh, no. I just want to break. Anyway, it's really pretty. <laughs> this is chinchilla oh my god I was obsessed with this I think I need to let this go though yeah I think I have to throw this out which makes me really sad I used to love this lipstick so I'm gonna throw it out this one is varsity I don't know I might put that in the maybe because I don't wear it that much oh I have to keep this one geranium this is such a cute, pretty color, geranium. Love it. So I'm definitely keeping geranium. Oh, I didn't show you my other lipstick queen. This is Chaotic Coca. I love this one too. It is such a beautiful brown. And it's got this beautiful marble. I don't know if you can see that. It's like a marble design. Okay, so my two Urban Decay that I have, I have Disturbed, which is a comfort matte. I love this lipstick. Oh my God, I love it. I have Heat, which is a metalized. I don't always love metallic, but I love, love, love this one. So I'll be keeping that. I love Urban Decay lipsticks. Okay, my two Bare Minerals, this is from the new mineralist hydra smoothing lipstick rain this one is the red inspiration this formula is out of this world i highly highly recommend trying these out and they're not too overpriced i just put lipstick on there oh my god and then i have energy which is a orange one of my favorites then we have my Laura Mercier in Rose Rouge, which is a, like a purpley red. And then I've got my two, um, what is this, L'Oreal Color Riche Shine, they both are. I have 245 and 466. Love, love, love this one. So I bought this one and loved it so much. Then I saw this one on sale. And so I bought this one. I haven't actually worn this one yet, but I love purple. So definitely excited to try that one out. So here we have my Tom Ford, and this is the Ultra Shine Lip Color in 01 Bear. This is what I wore on my wedding day. It's the most beautiful, neutral nude of my life. It's like my favorite lipstick. Not just because it's Tom Ford, it's actually the most incredible formula. Uh, and I want it to last me for the rest of my life. My Ulta 3, which is the other end of the spectrum, and these are all like $4 each. Australian brand, you can buy The Chemist. So this is Rose Bloom in a matte. We have Forever Fawn, which is just a cream. We have Cute Pink, which is like a cream, but it's got a little bit of a sheen to it. And then we have Vanilla Kisses. I'm running out of space. I really like that one. It's more of a yellow-based neutral. 
And then this one is Fire Breather, which is also a cream. And I love this one. I love, 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 love it. Okay, next we have NYX. This is a matte and it is in the shade Crave. I don't know where to put all my lipsticks. Let's put this one here. Crave. I really like that shade, so I'm going to keep it. I'm going to get rid of this white. The rest of them are all Maybelline, so I'm going to get rid of this white that's already damaged anyway. I don't know why I bought it. Um, Lilac Flush. I'm on the fence. Oh, I might keep that. That's quite a unique purple. Uh, this one is Sapphire Siren. I'm going to get rid of Sapphire Siren. I don't think I'm going to... Yeah, I'm not going to wear that. I'm not going to wear it, so don't keep it. The rest of them I'm going to keep. I know that I am because I wear all of these. My favorite one is Coffee Craze. It is so beautiful. And Peach Buff is a fave. I love Maybelline. I'm almost, I'm getting pretty low on this one. I bought a backup of this, isn't I'm Anna crazy. This is actually a matte, so it is quite matte. So I like to put a gloss over this one, but Peach Buff is beautiful. So I'm going to keep all of these. I'm not going to show you all of them, um, but this fuchsia one's really pretty. This one's the fuchsia for me. So yeah, really pretty. And what I'm going to do now is just kind of rearrange and oh, I am think I'm going to keep this Varsity. I've really decluttered quite a lot, so I'm going to keep Varsity. Okay, I wish I had a little bit of a better system for my liquid like this section, but what I have is you can't see, but I put a box back here so that they don't roll all the way back to where you can't access or see. So it's like there's like three layers, there's basically three layers here, two to three layers. Here is everything I have decluttered, shall we? Count it out. 31 lipsticks, guys. Can you believe it? Someone who I am obsessed with lipstick, it is everything and more to me and I've just gotten rid of all of this. I am so proud of myself. I have created so much space. If you like this video please give it a thumbs up. I'd really really appreciate it and subscribe if you haven't already. I will add this to my declutter playlist so if you want to check them out I will either card it and or link it down below in the description. I'll definitely have it in the description box. So thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in my next one. Bye! So